welcome back to our channel. Before I continue, I just wanted to say thank you for 107 subscribers. We are very thankful for that. I hope you could keep on supporting us throughout our journey on our YouTube channel. In this video, I'll be doing turning my friend Osis into a very good model. This is also like a part 2 of turning my friend Gacha character into a sweet model. Before we move on, I just want to announce that I'll be doing a dresses in your own style on Instagram. This contest will not have any prizes. This is just for fun. And I'll be choosing 5 winners. So go to our Instagram page. Just press the link in our description box down below. And now that's done, let's get started. So this is my friend OC. Let's call her for Mira. This is her OC Katie. So the name is Katie. Her personality, kind, soft, loving, shy, smart, generous, and honest. She is a nature lover. She likes to plant vegetables, fruits, and flowers. She always talks to animals and play with them. So let's make Katie. I'll just put her character in the bottom left. So you guys the character and the sweetie model. Uh, so uh, here's some small twist for this video while I'm uh, making this character. I am going to do like a small twist. Um, I am trying to do some few voice act voice acting in this video. And uh, sometimes in this video, I may talk about the character but in a different voice. Or I could like talk to Siri and Google Assistant while I am uh, while the video is while I'm doing this character so that's just some small changes I just want to uh, remind you guys because you think it like this there's something strange about the video so that's just my small warning <laughs> so anyway enjoy the video and uh, I'll be doing some different voices and talking to Siri and Google Assistant and stuff Hey Google! Hi, how can I help? Oh, I'm just wondering, how was your day? I had a great day. Hope yours was awesome too. Woo-wee! It was sure great! Oh no, I've lost my groove. But I'm working to improve. I could do a search for you. Like why is the sky blue? No, I said my day was also good. I'm glad to hear it. Let me know if there's anything I can do for you. Um, thank you very much, Google Assistant, but that's enough. Thank you. I always try my best. And thank you, too. Anytime. that I put makeup on characters now just to make them have more color in their face instead of making it plain. I just add sometimes small blush and some lipstick that is just very very light just to give it some uh, some pink and lip pink blush and some lipstick. And now we're doing the hair part. I actually had a hard time doing this part because my friend OC Kindy is ha it has two buns. It actually it was actually really hard to the uh, right So I actually asked her if I could do a different hairstyle for it. And she said yes. I'm very pretty I'm actually pretty happy when she said yes because it all it's almost taking me two hours to do the bun. <laughs> and now we came to the dress part. Since I was having a hard time in the hair earlier, 
I decided to do the clothing first because this was actually pretty easy. And I really love her outfit. It's very nature inspired. It has pink and green. It really matches her um design. I also have a small tip for you all in Vroid Studio. Here's my, my tip is to when you're putting colors already, I recommend or my tip is to put the colors in a layer, not on the default dress itself. This can be also applied to shoes, to pants, and other accessories that has to be colored. And now, this is the part where I started changing her hairstyle. I have another tip for all of you. For the hair, I recommend to separate the hair sections into different freehand group layers. What I mean is, make a first freehand group for the bangs only. And then make another freehand group for the back of the hair and others. I'm actually really like her, liking her hair right now. It's very nice to, it's really matching to her design. Now this is where the fun begins! I was going to now make the hair more realistic. And I suggest that when you're doing the animation for the hair right now, you should go to camper slash exporter and choose different kinds of moving poses for you to know if the hair is moving realistically or not realistically. <laughs> So now I'm just finishing up, which is testing her hair if it's moving realistically using some animations. And it looks like we're done! Thank you all so much for watching this video. And thank you also to Mira for giving her OC Katie to turn into a Vroid 3D model. And I hope you all have a wonderful day and we'll see you all in our next video. Bye!